Uh, two things. Um, just days after taking office and shortly after issuing that legislation that has gone nowhere in Congress regarding immigration and the border, the President issued an executive order saying he would, quote, restore and strengthen our own asylum system, which has been badly damaged by policies enacted over the last four years and contravened our values and caused needless human suffering. Our reporting, others' reporting, indicates the White House, through sources in the administration, is open to an authority that would allow it to suspend asylum processing when there's a spike in border crossings. Wouldn't that be a major policy reversal and revert back to the previous four years? I'm just not going to go into sourcing from here. I'm not going to get into specifics. There are negotiations happening. Not going to negotiate from the podium. I'm going to let the conversation happen. We have to find a bipartisan compromise. That's what the president said. That's what the president believes in order to deal with this issue. And you started off your question asking, or laying out, actually, that the president did put forth, and you laid that out in your question, uh, a comprehensive immigration reform plan. He did that on day one. And it is going on How three years, on three years. He spent pushing that on bill three with years. Because he's thing. met with them on foreign policy, right. on fiscal cliffs, and we on have, budget, and, and we, it's never been no, about immigration. I hear you, Ed, and we have regular conversations with congressional leaders and congressional staff about an array of issues, including this. I mean, this is the, you cannot send a bigger message to Congress and the American people when you say your first, when you put out your first piece of legislation is on this issue, is on reforming immigration, right? Is on fixing flat when you spend very little public time as president talking about the issue, meeting with congressional leaders on the issue specifically, or doing anything else other than having I you come out here and say, we issued a bill on day I one. I disagree. It's not just issue a bill. Like, not too long ago, back in the spring, we put forth policies on trying to make sure that, because, because Congress didn't help, on trying to put forth policies that try to make the immigration system humane, right? Humane and actually dealing with the issue that we're seeing at the border. We have taken policy actions after policy actions without without the help from Congress, you without, sure right? And so that is that is being consistent here. And when you put forth the first piece of, 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 uh, of legislation to be on this issue that has been broken for decades, I mean, that's what he did as president. That's taking it very, very seriously. Mitch McConnell alluded to something, a conversation he had with the president last week. I'm not asking you for names, mm -hmm. but can you at least confirm that the president has spoken with lawmakers directly on the ongoing talks to get the supplemental done. The president has been in regular touch with congressional leaders on this issue and obviously does so has his staff.